Carbs at Anium. I'm going to talk a little bit about our uh, latest video integrations, uh, sort of a follow-up to the last video we posted, show you some of the cameras, and uh, we're also going to talk a little about what's next, uh, what we're working on. We're looking at including, incorporating uh, some artificial intelligence, some AI into our cameras, um, so doing something with the video feeds that we have. Uh, in its current form, we have bas basic surveillance running, um, but you can do a whole lot more with video. Uh, so I'm going to give you a sneak peek into what's coming up. So right now, um, over here, we have a camera set up in the office, a thermal camera, and uh, we have this mock-up scenario. We actually have our mock-up of a well site. Uh, so we're, we're going to use a compressor that's connected to, a, um, to an actuator that we can control um, using a couple of Python scripts. And uh, right now, in a second, you're going to hear the uh, compressor kick on. So when the compressor kicks on, it's just feeding pressurized air into the line. We can actually see those pressures on, um, on our flow computer, which is kind of interesting. Um, but what we're going to do is uh, an example of maybe a, a safety critical uh, operation. So the video should pop up. So that's a thermal camera right in the corner. Um, as soon as a person walks into the frame or uh, you know, a, a technician walks on site, um, we want to turn off the safety critical device. Um, so in this case, the compressor. Uh, so I'm going to back away slowly into the frame. And now, once the camera detects that there is a person, the, uh, yep, there we go. So object detection has decided with over a 35% confidence that this is actually a person. Um, so yeah, I'm definitely human. Uh, the compressor turns off. And as soon as I walk out of the frame, come back over here, um, after a couple of seconds, the compressor turns back on. So once we're positive that there are no more people on site and it's safe to turn the equipment back on, the compressor goes back on.